Being a young woman with hardly any experience trying to break into the CNC machining industry was a huge challenge for me. I had a personal mill at home, but no job shop experience. In fact, I struggled to find any local shop that would take me seriously. I really wanted to learn the trade bad though, and I knew that I needed to be around the machines to really understand machining better and to learn the real challenges that machinists overcome every day. So I started taking a CNC machining class at a local community college, and I was hoping that the completion of the class would give me some more experience and also perhaps lead me to a job. At the time, I had no idea that it would actually completely change my life. So one day while we were in class, a shop owner came in and asked if any students would be interested in coming to work for him at his shop. He was looking to hire immediately, he said. I noticed nobody else in the class really seemed too interested in his position. So I decided to approach him. I told him I was very interested in the position he had available and that I would love to schedule an interview. He looked me up and down and said, you're really not the type we're looking for. I didn't have any words to respond to him with. I was completely taken off guard and I couldn't believe what he just said. I knew what he meant by it though. I was a woman, I was young, I had no experience. But I also knew he was wrong. Even though what he said was very discouraging to me, it was actually a blessing in disguise, I just didn't know it yet. So fast forward to the near end of our semester, the teacher had arranged a meeting with the man that created the curriculum we were learning, Titan, and also to tour his shop. During their discussions, Titan had asked my teacher if he had any students that would be a good fit for a role at Titans of CNC. My teacher noticed that I had been helping a lot of other students with the material, and so he actually suggested me as a potential match. I was completely honored and blown away that he would choose me out of all the others. He ended up connecting me with Titan's team, and we scheduled a date to meet and discuss the opportunity. So we ended up having our interview, which went really well, and Titan decided to hire me. He took a chance on me when nobody else seemingly would, and for that I'm forever grateful. In fact, I would have never imagined that I would eventually be teaching people the very thing that I had initially set out to learn myself. You see, if any of those other job shops would have hired me, I wouldn't be in the position I am now. So the moral of this story is sometimes when you think the odds are stacked against you because of whatever your gender, your age, your lack of experience, the truth is those struggles that are holding you back might actually be a blessing in disguise. So keep going, keep chasing what it is you want, regardless of the naysayers or the hurdles life throws at you, and everything will eventually fall into place and you will be exactly where you need to be when you need to be there. I would love to hear your guys' stories about your struggles and the hurdles that life threw at you that you might have thought was holding you back that ended up being a blessing in disguise. So drop your stories in the comments below and remember if you enjoyed this story, like and subscribe to our channel and there will be more soon. Thanks for watching guys.